put this up a little bit somewhat. Happy Easter weekend, everyone. Happy Easter weekend. So we're using this and we are using this. So, shall we just get started? I've already had a coffee and my brown toast this morning. But, oh, this is a bit squint, hang on. Um, I'm having a monster because I just need some triple caffeine in me. To keep me going. Right, so, let's have a play. Right, I'll pop this to the side. What did I do? What did I do? This is little um, die cuts. So, what I had done... Let me just organise this. What I've done is I was just um, trying to make the most of a bit of DSP. So I would thought maybe about making some um, paper clips with this. These. So it's just all the little figures. They're absolutely adorable. And then I've just done the same um, with a circle punch. Um, so these could be card toppers as well. Might use them in these cards. Look at that one, though, for a little baby card. Wouldn't that be cute? And it's got a little blue bird. <laughs> and this one, Friendship. I think this is just adorable. Let me get them out of the way. This was a couple of fussy cut bits. I think I actually sat and fussy cutted these one day. I was um, bed bound. Um, just so that I felt I was actually doing something. Right, so I've got lots of cards here. So I've prepped all these using, now there is a couple of sheets in that pack where there is like five scenes on the one sheet, so I'll cut them all up. Um, so there's one. This is another one, and I thought I would do them in nice bright colours to match the DSP. So we've got this and this. This one here is quite funny, it's a little girl dressed as an apple, not looking very happy. And we have this one here, which the onus is on um, a library and reading books. I thought that was really fun. So that's six by six, that one. And this one here is um, Friendship. I've not done a card base for that one yet. So, right, let's get organised. So I'm just going to work my... Hi, GM, Karen. I'm just going to work my way through making these up. So it's more of a just um, come and chatter with me. Now, the card I would like to use, if I go for, let me see now what colour. I think I will go for Gorgeous Grape for the card base. Now, I've not cut any um, card inserts or anything. And I am going to use, what will I use for the matte layer? I think I will use Azure Afternoon. So I'll need a sheet of this. Oh, and that's not even open yet. Let me get my scissors. So tell me, what's all your plans today, folks? While it's catching up, what I have to do today is... I was going to say it's an unexpected treat that you're on, then I remember it's Saturday. Are you losing track of days as well? <laughs> That's because it's Easter weekend. I was off work yesterday, but I still had to go to work because my husband was doing something for my work um, as a wee favour. And then I'm off Monday as well. Right, so... Let's make this, is this a six by six card? Did I see the biggest one or is it five? No, it's six, right, that's fine. I do have six by six um, envelopes somewhere. What I'm going to do, because I'm using A4, I'll just make it five and three quarters by five and three quarters. And it'll still fit in the six by six envelope because it's a little bit smaller. Move your clocks forward. Yep, they will do it automatically, thankfully, because I will always forget, Barbara. Um, five and three quarters. 
times two is what, ladies? Eleven and a half, isn't it? I think it's eleven and a half. And then we'll score it at five and three quarters. Hazel Ann's going home and sleeping. Oh, bless. Bless. Right, there's the card base, five and three quarters. So if I do this, five and a half for the mat layer. And then I'll need to trim down that lovely DSP. Oh, silly me, didn't um, cut that properly. Five and a half. Right, okay. I don't know what is in there with the trimmer. So, my plans are, after this, I need to go up the town centre or to be an m or something, because at three o'clock I have to go to my friend's house for her birthday. And I had actually suggested that all the girls bring a colour-themed tray. Um, let me cut this down to five and a quarter. A coloured-themed tray. I don't know if you've seen it on TikTok and what have you. Um... No, what do I want? Um, I think, what do I want to do that at? What was this one? This is five and a half, so this is going to be five and a quarter, sorry. So I suggested, why don't we all bring a um, coloured themed tree? And of course, I haven't had a minute to do anything. So I need to go to the shop and buy lots of blue stuff because my theme is blue. I ordered a blue dress and a blue tree and they're, they're not even here yet. And, um, yeah, so that's a bit annoying. So I need to go home <laughs> and, and um, find lots of blue stuff to fill a tree. Luckily, I've got blue trousers because my dress didn't arrive. And, um, yeah, so hopefully it'll all work out. Right, let me get my glue. Hi, Gemma. Hope everybody's well. Right, pop that on. Nice, colourful, colourful. Right, let me move this over a wee bit. Isn't this gorgeous? This is good for, um, got glue in that there. The Kitty Winky shoes in as well. <laughs> Just waiting on discharge papers. Oh, look at the back of this as well, though. You could do so much with this. So we're going to pop that on, like so. Now I'm going to get my little glue rubber because I've got glue on here. It's not quite dry, but it seems to be lifting. Okay, there we go. Lovely jovely. So that's my plans. And in between all that, I need to um, have a bath. I'll get organised. <laughs> right, I am going to actually just use this one on here. Now I am going to... Pick one of these pre-die cut shapes. Yep, I'm going to use that one. And I am going to use Celebrate. And I'm going to colour this in myself. So, Celebrate and let's see. Celebrate. Mm, celebrate a speedy recovery. No, wishing you a speedy recovery. No, celebrate the little things. That's what we'll do. Hi, Rachel. So I need the one that says the little things. I've just noticed it's got here a peaceful season. Celebrate a peaceful season. Speedy recovery. Best day ever. Celebrate the little things. Oh, maybe I'll do that. Right, where's the little things? Right, so I've got those there. Pop this back in here. Hi, Anne. How are you, my lovely, lovely, lovely? Right, I need a longer block for this. And I need some white cardstock. So I'm all up to scratch and have lots of um, all my cardstock replenished, but I forgot about white. Silver sausage. 
So I've got some right here. I think I'm down to about my last 10 sheets, but I'll need to get an order in soon. Right, let me just cut this to now. So just really easy, fun cards this morning. Right, this chair is really annoying me. It keeps, um, it keeps going down. And it's like I'm always sitting on the floor. Right, gorgeous crepe. Um, so I'm going to stamp the little things onto this little um, die cut thing. Cute. Hope I've stamped that. Oh no, I've stamped it a bit squint. It's because it's too far away from me. Right, that's better. Ta-da! Celebrate the little things. Can you see this okay or should I bring it down a wee bit? Bring it down a wee bit. Right, that's a bit better. That's a bit better. Now you can see what I'm doing. I'm just going to leave that on the block. Now this one I'm going to stamp. I'm going to stamp it in the same colour. I'm going to um, I'm going to actually colour the the inside. What is it with me stamping squint this morning? There's no excuse for it because these blocks make it so easy to stamp straight. There we go. Maybe I have had too much caffeine. <laughs> right, okay, so. Da -da 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 -da. Morning, everybody. Now, what we're going to do is we are going to take some of the colours that coordinate with this um, pack of papers. And we're going to colour them. So I've got them here on the back of the designer series paper packet. Right, let me move my juice out of the way before I spill it. Right, so let's see. I am going to colour, um, start colouring these letters and it'll make it nice and fun. Good morning, good morning. Um, I will apologise if the door goes or if the dogs bark because I'm actually in by myself. The young one stayed at a friend's last night and my oldest is away to get the train to Dundee because Wraith Rovers are playing Dundee um, United. So, hello Karen. So that's fun. Right, so there's Azura Afternoon. So I'm just going to work through. Do we have pumpkin pie in here? No, it's crushed curry. So let's do a crushed curry. And then I'll just cut this out with my trimmer. Now, the good thing about the Stampin' Out markers is they don't actually bleed. They're not alcohol markers, so you can go close to the edge as much as your wobbly hands allow you. Hi, Kirsten. Right, what other colours now? Let's see... Berry Burst. Now, the new nibs, the new style nibs are just like felt tip pens. So if you don't want to use a brush tip, you can use the, the nib, the smaller nib. Right, okay. So I'm just colouring this in. Oh, and I've went outside the line. But as you know, if you're doing this, just take your time. Celebrate. Margaret's just realised it's Saturday. Hello, hello. Um, right. Let's see what other ones. Azure Afternoon I've done. Fresh Freesia. Poppy Parade. Um, what other colours? I think I'll maybe do... 
fresh freezer. Hi, Karen, how are you? Now that's the old style nib on that, so I'm going to use the brush one. Celebrate. That's a Madonna song, isn't it? Right, I'm going to go for... Now, if you forget, you could have a wee look. Um, Poppy Parade, I think I'm going to go for. Because Poppy Parade is in it, isn't it? Poppy Parade, yes it is. Um, you could just use your DSP for reference. Oh, that's good. A nice pop of red breaks it up nice. Does anybody remember being little and being OCD about not um, going out with the lines in your colouring book? <laughs> right, I'm just going to go for a bit Coastal Cabana just, just to get a little bit green in there. Greeny blue. Yay! Oh, brilliant, honey. All good. Hi, Lisa. Right, let me get this out of the way. Right, I think I'll use my little trimmer because I've got it here. My little guillotine one. Ooh, squeaky squeaker. Squeaky squeaky. Right. Let the top line away. This is quite fun. Celebrate the little things. Now, I'm going to put him over there. That up here. And I'll put that here as well. Now, I'm thinking, is there anything else I can pop on there? Let's see now. No, 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 no. Um, I think, I think I'll mount this up on a matte layer. And then go from there. Do, 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 do. Oh, my rubbish singing's back in full force. <coughs> oh, goodness, that squeak's annoying. Squeak, squeak. So celebrate the little things. Yeah, I think I'll put it like that. Right, okay, dimensionals, dimensionals. It's been a funny week for forgetting what day it is and stuff, isn't it? Sure has. Right, I'm only needing three dimensionals on here. So this morning I was up at seven o'clock doing lots of vinyl onto um, t-shirts for our local football team next saturday they are having a what do you call it i've just seen a wee gap there they're having a hospitality day so i've got a load of t-shirts there done for them to help raise funds for the club this is squeaks too <laughs> brilliant right should put should I put him there and then have this little girl jumping on the cushions? See, I think that's covering up too much. If I put him there and then I could put her. Yeah, let's do that. Right, let's pop him up with dimensionals as well. So just some really fun cards this morning. Fail to go through all these dimensionals, which is a good thing if you're because it means you're crafting. Just going to pop them off with my pokey tool. Oh, upside down. Right, I'm going to do him um, like that. Um, I think I'll just leave her off actually. He's has become conditioned to hospital schedules. Oh. No nice though. I'm just going to cut a bit of this off. Cut a bit of this off the edge for my little sentiment. Right, 
So, so tell me what's all your plans this weekend. Hi, Ali. I should have put it down here, or should have put it up there. Where do you think I should position this? I can't, I really can't make up my mind this morning. First one to see, up here, under there, or here, or in the bottom corner. I'll take a wee drink of my juice while I see. Please help. Hazel's looking up. Right, cool. Up. Thank you, Lisa. Hazel's looking forward to getting back to crafting. Right, there we go. Celebrate the little things. Okay, let's get some bling on this. Bling, bling, bling. Now, these are really fun ones. Online exclusive adhesive back shiny sequin. These are part of the zinnias. Um, so, let's pop some of these on. Pink. An orange. And a green. And I'm going to pop a couple down there. So we'll go with five, uh, doo -doo -doo -doo. and I'll go with a littler one. There we go. That's nice. And you can um, put Wink of Stella or what have you on them. Right, that's good. I'll keep these close by. Come on, in you go. Of course, it's not gone back in because I'm on camera. Right, okay, I'll just leave them as is now. Right, next week card is... Where did I put them? Where did I put them? Oh, there they are. Right, so that's the first card. I'll pop that out of the way. The second card is Lemon and Lime Twist with a black matte layer. It is cute. Thank you. Now, this is just a smidgen of a border on this one. And I've chosen this piece. How cute is that? Oh, look, I've just realised that we guys got a prosthetic leg. So this is a really good set combined with that stamp for celebrating um, diversity and disabilities and things as well. Right, let's get this little grumpy kid dressed as an apple. <laughs> Brilliant. Right, I'm just going to chuck her on. We did put my dimensionals. Now, this one, I am going to put a black sentiment on it that I've already prepped. So I'll do that in a wee second. So nobody's told me their plans this weekend or have you not thought about it yet? Are you all still gym jamming it? Come on, off you get. Well, this is quite a good one as well. Ooh. No, I'll do this one because I was wanting, I had a, I had a plan. I had a plan for it. Right, okay. So I'm going to pop her right in the middle, like so. And I'm going to get some sentiments. Let's see now. Um, what was I wanting to do? I was wanting to do... Hope this is a feeling better kind of day. Because she looks grumpy. <laughs> so I'm 
So I'm just going to pop that on there. I'm going to layer it on a piece of lemon and lime twist. You know, sometimes I didn't even think about the fact that it's Easter weekend um, doing an Easter themed project. Rachel's in PJs. Lisa's breakfast in crafting. Brilliant. Brilliant. Right, I'm just going to cut this by hand. Oh, that's cute. I do like that. Right, let's get dimensionals. Easy peasy lemon squeezy. Okay. Now what I'm going to do, whoops, where did that go? Stick to my, oh, I've got it. What I'm going to do is I'm going to use one of some of this ribbon that's retiring. So it's a lemon and lime twist one. So I need some... I like this, you just make it up as you go. I'm going to put some tearing to um, stamp and seal in there. And I am very quickly going to add some ribbon. Do I need some more tearing tape? Yes, I do. Not tearing tape, stamp and seal. Goodness me. Right. This is a fun wee ribbon. So I'm just kind of zigzagging it on like so. And then I shall put this on. Right, now I'm going to move it over a little bit because that sentiment is smaller than I thought. Okay this on and that just gives it a wee bit 3D-ness oh times PJ and admin day supporting team training first aid organising eight weekends courses and she's some folk who haven't paid me oh nothing worse hun nothing worse let's get some bling on he's man PJ's oh have you had a heart attack and oh bless him I hope he's okay and speedy recovery, Tim. Right, I'm just going to use some green adhesive back sequins in the corner there. So that's quite cute as well. I like, I like how these are turning out. They're just such fun, aren't they? Right, let me pop that to the side. Okay, next card is this. Now, let me clear up a little bit. So, this is as uh, as your afternoon, sorry. The kids jokey so you're crafting bills. Oh, brilliant. Yeah, I don't think many of our partners or husbands or wives do, do we? <laughs> they would get a blooming shock, I tell you. Right, this is Daffodil Delight going on. And we have a little scene here, a little shoot and a little um, tree swing. So let's pop that down. And the good thing is about these, um, about these papers is you don't actually need to do a lot to dress them up. Um, so I thought this little grumpy um, girl could go on the top of the shoot or the slide, whatever you call it. And then the other little one, who's investigating bugs, can go on the grass. Now, I'm going to sneeze. <laughs> oh, excuse me. Wow. I am still trying to get rid of this lurgy. And now my husband's got it. And you know what men are like when they get the cold? Oh, it's disaster. The world is falling apart. <laughs> right, that's that wee girl on there. This one I'm going to put down here at the bottom of the chute. Bless me, thank you. <laughs> it's just when you get a cold, 
Oops, that's too close to the edge. A little cold tingle in your nose and then that just sets me off. Right, get these backings off. Now this is going to be a friendship themed one. So I'll pop her down there. And I am going to see what sentiments I have. That's anniversary, that's BB. This one here from Life is Better, the Friends Like You. I'm going to use that one. Okay, and I think um We'll pop that up in a bit of Azure Afternoon. Yes, let's do that. So that set is actually retiring as well. I really like that one. Right, let's just cut this. Perfect. I'm going to pop it right in the middle. See, it doesn't take a lot to uh, make fun cards using this paper. So I'm just going to pop that in the middle. Is that in the middle? Yep. I love it. Some more little gems. And I think I will go for some pinks. Maybe some peachy colour. And, whoops, that's just fell off. And a green. There we go, another quick card. Hazel Ann says, there's, it sounds like there's a lot going around. Yeah, it's horrible. Horrible, horrible. Right, put that to the side. The next card is this little one, which is four by four. So we've got a Zura Afternoon. Covered in ink already. Daffodil Delight. There we go. And we've got a little kind of like rain thundery scene here. And the way I've cut it, I thought mm, that looks like almost like it's a river. Hence why I chose to put the little toy boat with these wee guys in it. So I'm going to put it at an angle so it looks like they're really, 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 really having fun. So lots of dimensionals again. For the smaller pieces, you can use your mini dimensionals. I don't have mine to hand, I'm afraid, so I'm just going to cut or use a little bit excess from the edge. If it stops sticking to my fingers. Right, gently peel that off. Yeah, so, has anybody got any news? Karen likes a 4 by 4 card. They're so dainty, aren't they? Get off you, bugger. I don't think I have any news. I did find out one of my old school friends had passed away yesterday, though. That was a bit of a shock. Reading about it last night. She was only 45, same age as me. Right, let's get those fun ones on. Brilliant. Brilliant. Right, sentiment for this one. I'm going to go for... Um, let me see. Oh, decisions, decisions. What about one that says happiness? Yep, let's do that. Let's do this wee baby one that says happiness. What else is there? I've still got to um, do some more of these. Oh, let's do this as well. The little things. Happiness and the little things. And best day ever. Let's overload it. Now, do I want to put this up with 
foam. Yes, I will. Right, let me use my... Oops, sorry, I'm wobbling that. Let me use... Oh, I know, it's so sad, Karen. Let me use this, which is the foam strips. These are great for little sentiment things as well. So I'll pop that on. Oops, ever so slightly too long. Do you know what? Tomorrow is never promised, folks. Right, so happiness up there. I'm going to put the little things here and then the best day ever down there. No, I'm not going to do the little things, actually. I'm going to put that away. I'm just going to do happiness and then the best day ever. So only need a little bit of foam on this right hand side. Cute cards. <laughs> they are. They sure are. Hi, Lindy Mae. Nice to see you. Nice to see you to see you nice. What's that, Bruce? From the prices, right? <laughs> I need to get my nails taken off. Well, the gel take them off. And give my nails a little rest. Right, I'm just going to pop that there. I'm just going to pop a little bit of glue on here to hold that down. I should have put that on first, but forgetful me. Oh, a little bit of excess glue coming out there, but that's fine. That will dry clear. Happiness, the best day ever. Now, I'm going to use some yellow on this, yellow gems. Go me actually using my embellishments instead of holding them. Um, and another yellow. Little trio. Hazel saying, I agree. You never know what's coming. You sure don't, hun. Ta da! Right. Next card is this one. This is a big six by six. And this is the reading theme one. Again, just using one of the scenes from one of the pieces of the DSP. I'm very haphazard with my glue, am not I? <laughs> These would look nice on the wonk as well if you were to make the matte layers a bit smaller and then kind of put them on the wonk. That would look quite fun. Look at this one, we dragon up there. We goldfish. It's almost like a school scene or a playroom. Right, okie doc. Pop that there. Isn't she adorable? Absolutely adorable. Right, let's just pop these kitty malinkies on. Do, do, do. What time are we at? Because I'm almost 22 already. I am almost finished. It's going quite quick, isn't it? So pop her there. Pop these two friends down here. Super cute, guys. Super, super cute. I don't know if the um, comments are maybe a bit laggy on here. I'm not ignoring anyone. Apologise if I don't see any of your comments. In fact, I'm going to put them there. Right in the middle. Right, so... What can we do for this one in terms of sentiments? I think a friendship one would be good. In fact, I know what I'm going to do. I'm going to do celebrate the little things. So I've already got some black, uh, white on Boston to black. So celebrate and then we'll use this one, the little things. Right, let me get these away. And these are out of the Happy Little Things stamp set that I'm, I'm trying to showcase today. Right, so, celebrate. I think I'll put that there. And that there. Or I'll put that bang on in the middle. 
I think I'll pop that there. I'm just going to put this on a bit of the Azure Afternoon. It's a really nice blue, this. Oh, did you get the email, honey? <laughs> yeah, I thought I'd send out and just warn people with some of the, like, staple items that are actually going up in price in the new catalogue. Right, this is too... This is too long. So I'm just going to cut this by hand. That's just a little bit too big for that little guillotine. Yeah, very vanilla, thick cardstock's going. Vellum's going as well, so I just thought I'd pop that out in an email to people to let them know. And there's some small price increases coming for things like snips and adhesives and what have you, so. Anybody's needing anything, you better to order them now and just save a few pounds. All right. We are almost, almost done. Doesn't feel like I've been on long to be honest, but that's um, 45 minutes nearly. Right, I'm going to pop this one coming out from the side. About there. This I think I'm going to cut into three. So I'll watch this. I think it's quite nice just to randomly pop these around. Right, so and put them on at a, 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 a speak again at an angle. He's all saying, "Why is Vellum going?" I'm not sure to be honest, hun, because um, I like it. I think I think Vellum is one of these things. Like I've got a packet, and there's still lots of it left. It's I think it's a product that people don't. Overused, they only use it in small, small um, portions kind of thing. So maybe there's not a lot of people buying it. Um, I'll definitely be getting a few packs before it retires, though, because um, I do love it. I do love it. Let's get that off of there. So this makes it quite fun, just putting your words on at a wee angle. Hi, Joe. Good morning or good afternoon, Mr. Coogan. And vanilla cash soap mustn't be popular, no. I've got nearly two full packs. Vanilla's just not one that I tend to, to use. Um, right, so this is going to go this way. So celebrate the little things and we need some bling on this as well. Now, let me see. I am going to use, I'm going to pop some gems. Why have I lifted two? That's fine. I'm going to do, I'm going to do um, repeat in opposite corners. I'm going to put three in each corner. So, berry burst, lemon and lime, and then a small lemon lolly colour. Fantastic. He's a one loves using vanilla. It goes well with green. Yeah, and I, when I think of the vanilla, I think of like wedding cards and christening cards and things like that. Um, that's a shame. It's a shame. It's not that one I use a lot, but for people that do use it, it's, it's sad. It's sad when good things go. So the vellum... Um, I don't know where mine just went now, actually. Um, no, I've not got it to hand or I would have showed you. I would have showed you. Oh, such a cute pie, pie card. Oh, thank you. So that's the card there. Here is the other one we made and we coloured. So this stamp set goes really good. It's an online exclusive, so it's available until it runs out, basically. Um photopolymer so you can see through it and stamp better unless you're like me and just have wobbly hands sometimes <laughs> so it goes really well with these fun papers here's the other one hoping this is a feeling better kind of day with a little grumpy grumpy girl 
Then we have a friendship one. We've got a little grumpy girl here. I'm sure this will remind you of certain grandkids or things like that. Um, and then the wee girl at the bottom. And then this one here is quite fun. So one, two, three, four, five cards. That was from one sheet. I don't know if I still have. Oh, yes, I do. Here's, the, here's what it looks like before you cut it up. So it's quite fun. It really is quite fun. Um, it just is a lovely, a lovely, lovely um, set of papers. So um, I need to get using more soon. So yeah, thank you so much everybody for coming on. Um, do remember, I do have a hostess code um, running at the minute. I think it's this one. If you're ordering online, pop that in at checkout. You'll see it on my website as well if you want to go and write it down or, or what have you. Um, yeah, I'll be putting an order away on the 17th of April. So if anybody would like anything added into that, maybe save you a wee bit of postage, just let me know and I'll be happy to do that. And whatever your plans are for the rest of the day, I hope you have the best day. Um, I'm going to be a blue bummed free now for the rest of the afternoon. So by the time I get to my friends at three, I will certainly need a little alcoholic beverage. So I'm looking forward to it. It's a lovely day. Right, guys, thank you so much for watching. Um, this will be on YouTube at some point over the weekend. I'm not sure when because, like I say, I'm really busy. And I'm out tomorrow for a bit as well. Um, so I'm kind of glad I'm off on Monday because I'm going to be shattered. Right, folks, have a good one and I'll see you again soon. Bye.